Uh, the one aspect of this that I've been very concerned about, especially on Friday and Saturday, sitting uh, in uh, Six Cottage Leisure Centre, was seeing the really fantastical prices charged by hotels, almost on an escalator online, an algorithm. You see money, just the prices going up and up and up. So that's why I asked officers to work immediately with the hotel trade to make sure that we were being charged base prices or reasonable prices, even though it's tourism season in London, not peak prices. And I'll report back on that. We should remember, of course, that all expenditure over £500 per contractor is published online at the end uh, of uh, uh, each and every month. So that these prices will be transparent. And I'm sure the hotel industry will want to show that it's played its part during this and not be seen as making profit from a civil emergency. And I think there's some wider lessons for London should this uh, situation like this emerge and why the London's hotel industry has to work with the Mayor of London and the boroughs to make sure that we've got something in place because it was chaotic, very much chaotic to start with, finding people homes if we have to move people in significant numbers.